My name is Sue Humphreys and um, I do information security, data security, um, compliance and right now my huge focus is on cyber security and I've been working in the industry for about 15 years. Uh, the, you're looking at privacy of your, your, your interviewees, uh, where you're finding your information, that sort of thing. You know, it's a, it's a two-part factor, really, if it's sensitive, about sensitive issues. A non-disclosure agreement is a key thing, so between a journalist and whoever you're interviewing, depending on the sensitivity of, of, of the information. And privacy of the data that you are you're taking, you would really need, about storage, for example, you'd need to look at, if you're going to store in the cloud, and this is the big buzzword, it's in the cloud. My question is, where's the cloud based? People look at me blankly and say, it's the cloud. No, it's not actually a real cloud. It's got to be based somewhere. And so you actually should look at the jurisdiction of where the cloud is based. So for example, if you were doing an interview in France or in the United Kingdom, and it's of sensitive information, uh, you wouldn't want it stored outside of the EEA. Or if you did do that, you would want it stored in, to, in, a, in an area where there are controls in place. So for example, in the United States, companies sign up for safe harbor. So therefore, there, there are a number of key controls which the United States government put in place. Let's say can, if you put your data in the cloud and it happens to be in um, Greenland, Greenland, for example, they may not be, they may not have the control. So therefore, there's no safeguarding of data.